Now, with viewing figures of over 15 million, the romantic drama One Day, based on David Nichols' best-selling book, of course, currently the world's most watched British TV show, So There. And my next guest, Johnny Weldon, has won rave reviews for his portrayal of Ian. It has to be, I think Ian is, well, he's the most lovable character. Do I have something on my face? No, no. No, you just look, you look so lovely. Thanks. Any drinks? Ah, uh, yeah, I love a vodka and tonic. Very good. Please. Is that a double? Oh, God, is that too reckless? Oh, proceed, fair maiden. <laughs> and for you, sir? I'll hang on for the wine. Grazie. Do you know what you want yet? Oh, um, <clears throat> minute steak looks good. Mm -hmm. Or is that minute steak? As in, is it cooked for 60 seconds or is it just a really, really small steak? Oh, well, actor Johnny Belden joins me now. Johnny, he's adorable. Oh, he's trying boy. too hard, though, there. He is. He's keen, is he? Yeah, you, yeah. Just, you just want to say, Ian, you're fine. Just take a breath. You don't have to try that Yeah, exactly, hard. exactly. You don't. It's nuts, isn't it? Mm. So, that, I mean, did you have any idea when you were doing this that this was going to be the biggest thing ever? Oh, no. I mean, so, because I got the audition, got the job, filmed yeah. it, wrapped on it, like, back in 2022. Wow, so it's all done and dusted and back then. Yeah, right? and I think, like, you know, when you're on a job, it's kind of hard to... Because you're in it, it's hard to know what it's going to be like. Right. But I do remember on set, I'd look round at Leo, Ambika, the brilliant actors, the four great directors, the amazing execs, Nicole Taylor, David Nichols, obviously, and I was like, this has the ingredients mm. to be something really special. And then all of last year, I'd, like, meet up with Ambika and Leo and we'd go, when's that thing that we did? <laughs> Is that coming out? <laughs> what, what is it? And then uh, it came out and apparently it's being watched around the world, which is it's amazing. You and... won't be able to go anywhere. You won't be able to go to Antarctica. There'll be penguins. You say that. Go... I, had a, I was in a coffee shop a couple of days ago and there was this lady. She couldn't place me, though. She was just staring at me, yeah. frowning like that. She went, where do I know you from? <laughs> and then I found myself going, oh, well, I'm in a show called One Day on Netflix. And there was, like, me <laughs> plugging it to this lady. <laughs> But that's great. We'll get used to that. Because yeah, yeah. You nearly didn't audition, you silly thing. What happened? Well, yeah, I mean, I, I, um, the audition came through when I was on holiday with my wife. Right. You know that, like, sod's law thing, if you want a job, go on holiday. Yes. And that's when it will come through. And we were in the Isle of Arran. Oh, lovely. So not, And you know, Beautiful. it's one, one of those holidays where, like, turn off your phone. Yes. Turn off the emails. And it came through, and uh, I was about to start a theatre job around a similar time. And uh, my agent was like, you know, if you're a bit busy, you're on holiday, just think about it. And it was my wife who went, what's it for? I said, oh, they're doing David Nichols one day. And she went, you are, <laughs> you are auditioning for that. It's my favourite book. Um, but I was on holiday, so I had to do, you know, it was a self-tape. Yeah, yeah. So I had to get, like, 30 books from this hotel room and, like, prop my phone and oh, geez, stand up. Oh, and know, do that. And then had about... 100 recalls and, uh, and, <laughs> and then some, there somehow you got it, yeah. It's fantastic. Thank the thing you. about you, though, is you'd be used to that making videos because I know you before this <laughs> because I follow you um, on the on the YouTube and all of that the malarkey. Web. And you're hilarious. Thank you. You do these things where it's like you're an actor. Yeah. You know, you are an actor, for goodness sake. It's not like you are an actor, but you've got this persona. Yeah, well... It's so funny. It's so, so funny. I think... Um, I think because I've been, I've been acting since I was a kid, yeah. right? And I've been in, like, plenty of auditions and press nights, and I just think there's lots of funny things in oh, the world, like, lots of funny people. And then during the lockdown, I spent eight months uh, at my now wife's dad's house. She, she was there as well. It wasn't okay. just me and her. <laughs> and oh, that would have been fun. Yeah. And I was doing all the kind of day jobs, like I was selling wine over the phone, I was doing food delivery, I was like, just trying to get by, yeah, and, like, there was no acting. And then one day, I made a little video for fun, and I sent it to my mate Joe, Joe Ashman, he's an actor as well, and he was like, put this on the internet. Mm. And I said, no, nobody wants to see it. And he said, do it. So I did it, and it got about 100,000 views on, on, I'm not on surprised. one of the socials. And, um, and I was like, oh, I'm onto something now. <laughs> so I just kept doing them, and sometimes not many people would watch them, and then other times it'd be like half a million people have watched them. And, yeah. uh, and it was, but it was always about, you know, being an actor. I know, and other actors watch it, and you've got other actors involved. Just, there's just a little taste of what Johnny you got, does. You like got one. <laughs> Bond audition Wednesday. Da, da, da. We are seeking inclusive, diverse casting, opening the roles to new ethnicities. <clears throat> what? I didn't. Then, well, I just thought, you know, because I'm ginger, that's... Right. I'm, obviously, I'm under five foot five, so... I'm five four, actually. Uh... But, yeah, other than that, I'm just, uh, you know, British... 
born Emmy nominated actors. Don't think I asked about the Emmy. <clears throat> Hello there. I'm here to audition for Bond. Jane Bond. <laughs> that is so funny that Thank you got you. all of those amazing people. I, know. I, I don't know how that because happened. They, no, but they get it. That's the yeah. thing. They just get it. It's but, hilarious. Like, Nick Mohammed and Hannah, they're so generous with their time. Mm. Nick was on a on a shoot, I think, at the time, and Hannah had just come off some press thing and they were so sweet. They were I was like, Can I please just have you for ten minutes on Zoom? And uh did a and video did and it. there you go. And you said being in this, it sort of stops your relatives from saying, you know, being in one day. Are we going to see you in anything? It does stop that, <laughs> yeah. You know, when are we going to see you on the telly? I mean, it's on demand now as well, so I can... In five years, I can say, you can still watch it. You can it. still watch it. Yeah, you can see yeah. it whenever you want. I'm on the telly. <laughs> I think it's absolutely brilliant, and it's a great series, and it's kind of erased the memories of the movie because that just didn't really work. You, this has worked so well. Right. And it's, come out at the, it's just come out at the right time. And for you, I mean, this has catapulted you, I would imagine. It's, it's hopefully you're going to be batting away lots of offers. Well, I one mean... One would hope, You Jody. hope so. One would um, hope. One would hope. I mean, you know, it's kind of... It's, it's just come out, it's early days. It's only been out for a couple of weeks, so we'll have to wait and see. But, um, yeah, you know, I mean, hopefully this is an exciting I kind, hope kind so. of chapter. It's certainly the, the biggest... I've done bits of telly and plenty of theatre, but it's certainly the biggest TV job yeah. I've done. But I, ha I have to say, I have to thank the casting department for it, really, that Rachel Sheridan cast this. And uh, like without her taking a... Championing me, I suppose, and yeah. kind of... Because I found out recently that when she got the job, she had me in mind straight away for Ian. Oh, that's good. Like, and so without her doing that and thinking that, I literally wouldn't be yeah. here right now. And so it's just kind of funny how these things work out, but... It's, it's the right time. It's know. the right time. Now, look, this is, this is where it gets even more surreal, right? Okay. Because fans of One Day... They've been flocking to all the locations right. in the drama. And the cafe run by Dexter, there it is, has been... Now, queues, Johnny, queues out the door <laughs> since the show launched two weeks ago. And I know you go there. Yeah. Well, Lucy Cave is actually there for us in North London this morning. This wee place, yeah. they must be kicking their height. This is the best thing that's ever happened, right? Yeah, indeed. One Day Fever has struck us all, and as you said, fans are flocking to locations where the TV series was filmed. I'm outside what in the show is Dexter's Cafe, Cafe Belleville, but in real life, it's called La Maison in North London. And even though Dexter, played by Leo Woodall, is only in it for a few seconds in the penultimate episode, fans are quick to decipher the real location. It's become a TikToker's hotspot ever <laughs> since. It's getting really busy in here. So earlier on, I caught up with cafe owner Mehmet Garekli and asked him what impact it had. So we've basically seen quite a lot of increase during the weekends since it's been launched. And obviously we had people writing to us saying, we want to come visit your cafe. We've got people taking photos of it outside all the time. Although even if they don't come in, they just record it and then go, and then they come back another time. We've got quite a lot of locals anyway, so they're our main customers. But there's been a, quite a lot of addition from what it has been before. So one of the locals is here at Sheridan. I've just accosted you now. Sheridan, um, how has one day affected you? Oh, I loved it. Uh, <laughs> cried myself to sleep. <laughs> and 15th of July, which is St Swithin's Day, which is obviously the one day that appears throughout the TV series, apparently there's going to be a big meet-up in this very cafe. What are you going to be doing on the 15th of July? Probably avoiding this cafe. <laughs> <laughs> Probably on holiday. Thank you very much, yeah. Sheridan. I'm going to go and order a coffee now. Um, Dexter's favourite, please. Can I have Dexter's favourite? Okay, yeah. Hopefully Dexter, played by Leo Woodall, is going to appear in here. I know, Johnny, you were in this very cafe. He was. Johnny, you were there yesterday. I was. Yeah, I live in North London. Right. And I'm, um, I'm doing the marathon this year, so I was out training. <gasps> there we are, you? look. There you are. So I popped in there, cos, yeah, I saw on TikTok, it's there, and um, I got a, a latte on the house. D see the joys of stardom, Johnny. Oh, you got I know. one on the house? Yeah, the so I might pop back there tomorrow and every day after that. <laughs> every well. day? Good luck with the marathon. Thank you, yeah, That's really daunting. A, that is a toughie, but, yeah. you, but it's great. The crowd are worth about five miles. Yes. You'll yeah, be yeah. fine Very and you'll fun. enjoy it. Good luck with that. Thanks so Good much. Good luck with everything, Johnny. Keep doing your videos, though. OK, Even when you're a big superstar. Yeah. Can I do, I'll do one based on like, going on a chat show. Is Could like, you? Can I do Could that? Could you do that? Right, fine, really, really take the mic. That's me inspiration for my next one. Excellent. <laughs> and you can watch, of course, you can watch One Day on Netflix. And people are watching it again and again, not just once. Yeah. So lovely to see you. Thank you so Thank much you. for having me on, Lorraine. Thank you. 